everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, we are unboxing our BoxyCharm Premium. I'm so excited because this showed up on my front doorstep today and I cannot wait to see what is inside. So uh, before we get started, if you guys are not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that button down below. I would love to have you. You can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, all that good stuff. And I would have those links down below as well. So let's open this bad boy up and see what we got for May Premium. Yeah. Ooh, oh, oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> ah. Um, so right away, I do see something I'm really, really excited about, but we're gonna set this down. All right, so the first item we have is from Skin & Company Roma. This is their Truffle Therapy Reconstructing Truffle Eye Contour Concentrate. Yes, I do like eye products, especially because I am a little bit more mature skin. So lines, wrinkles, all that good stuff. Uh, <laughs> I love any products that can help with those. So yeah, I mean, oh, that's cute. It says hello, bright eyes in the beginning. So all right, this packaging is cute. This is what it looks like right here. Ooh. Oh, it smells like a truffle. Oh wow. <laughs> that is a that is a really nice smell. I like the consistency of it. Kind of feels like very, very creamy, like a whipped eye cream. So I'll be excited to test this out and uh, see if it really works. Oh, that smells delightful. <laughs> that really does. I like that. Alright. First one, good. All right, the next item we have, interesting. Uh, it is from Kat Von D. This is their Super 24 Hour Brow Long Wear Pomade. So I know a lot of people have their feelings about the whole Kat Von D um, brand, especially from when she was owning it. I guess she doesn't own the company anymore. I don't really know what's going on with that. I haven't bought from Kat Von D in a very, very long time. There is one item that I have not found a replacement for that I would, could see myself repurchasing in the future. But as far as anything else, I really haven't been excited about anything and I've pretty much stayed away from that brand. Um, but this is in the shade medium brown, which is definitely my brow shade. So. I like the packaging of it. That's still really cool. But uh, yeah, I'll have to give this out. I'm not really a pomade kind of person. That definitely would work for me though. So yeah, I'll definitely have to test this out and see if I'm gonna like it or not. The next item we have is from Sugar Rush. This is a brand by Tarte. I'm, if I'm not mistaken, this is their uh, vegan brand. Uh, this is a lip butter balm called Best Bud in the shade Peony. Is that how you say it? I'm not really sure. I might have said that wrong. Oh, that's cute. Got a little flower top to it. It says Sugar Rush on the front. A little cute design. Oh. <laughs> That smells so good. I could sit here and smell this all day. What does that smell like? I don't even know. Some kind of candy. Oh man. I already have lip gloss on, but oh, I'm excited for this. I am excited to have this all over my lips. It smells so good. All right, another item we have. Once again, this box is very skincare heavy. Like, do I need to redo my profile to make sure? Because I do prefer boxes that have more makeup. And I've said this in my last unboxing. I got like two items of skincare, or two items of makeup, and the rest was all skincare. And it seems to be that case again. So, I might just have to redo my profile, because I want more makeup. <laughs> I like skincare. Don't get me wrong. I do enjoy skincare, but I would like more makeup. Um, so the next item is from Pure Heels by Nature Village. Um, what is this? 
It says it ends at even out skin tone with a toner and apply a moderate amount of product onto the face. Gently pat for better absorption. Okay, so I guess it's a toner. This is what the box looks like. Cute little box. I wonder what it smells like. Oof, that stinks. I don't know if I'd be able to put that on my face. It smells like... Oof, I got it on my nose. Oof. It smells like medicine. Got it on my nose again. That was not smart. Yeah, I don't know how to describe that. It kind of smells like medicine a little bit. So, I don't know how I feel about that. I don't even have any, I haven't even really heard of this brand. Have you guys heard of this brand? Uh, let me know down in the comments below. Right, the next item we have is from Milk Makeup. Now, Milk Makeup is actually like a hit or miss for me. I've liked like a product or two, and then there are other products I did not like at all. Um, so this is, what is this? Glow Oil Lip and Cheek, a sheer blush and lip stain packed with hydrating rice bran oil for a shimmering wash of color. So I am going to count this as a makeup product considering you can use it for a blush, but if it was just another lip balm, there would be no reason to have two lip balms in the box, in my opinion. So this is the packaging right here. It's super tiny. I thought they were supposed to be like big sticks. Um, this definitely does not seem full size to me. And it doesn't even go all the way down. It looks like the product stops right about there. So about halfway maybe. It's a very pretty color though. Can you see that? That would be a pretty blush. Let's go ahead and give this a swatch. It looks a bit sticky. Doesn't really have a smell to it, but I think it'd be too. Mm, if I could share it out, it, it is sticky though. It could be a light blush. I just don't know about the consistency of it. Hmm. Okay. All right, well, I will test it out. It's definitely a product I haven't tried before. I couldn't say that I'm super excited for it, um, but it's okay. All right, the last item. I am so excited for this one. This one makes me happy. <laughs> this is the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette. Oh, I actually wanted this palette, but I just never really pulled the trigger for it. Um, I love Too Faced shadows. One of my ultimate favorite palettes is the Sweet Peach palette, and I'm super excited to have this, you guys. Like, so dang excited. Oh, oh, the packaging is so pretty. Look, oh, look how gorgeous that is. Like, that is just so dang pretty. I do like that it pops up just a little bit, but not too much. It's got a really good heavy weight to it. Whoa. Oh. Definitely can create some really pretty looks with that. Isn't that gorgeous? That's so pretty. Oh, it smells like heaven. Mm, it's got like that chocolatey smell that they're known for. Oh, yes. Okay, well, that is it. I don't have a card for some reason to tell me the prices on everything, which is usually kind of weird. Like, I've never had a box not have a card. Anybody else have that? I don't know. So let's just go over real fast what we did get and my thoughts. So obviously, um, the Neutral Matte Palette, one of my favorites from the box. I'm very, very excited for this. This one makes me super happy because I really, I actually wanted it. Um, the Milk Makeup product, eh, it's okay. It's a little sticky, but I will see how it works. Maybe I will end up actually liking it. Uh, the Brow Pomade, I don't really use pomades, but it is the exact shade that I need. So maybe I'll actually be able to put this to use. This 
smells like heaven. This lip balm from Tarte. Super excited for that one. Uh, we have the toner, which kind of smelled like medicine. I have to think about what to do with this one. And of course, the eye cream, which smells super, super nice. I'm really excited about it. I love the consistency of it, and I really do enjoy eye creams. So this is definitely not a bad box. I did enjoy it. Um, I don't know. <laughs> we'll definitely go ahead and see what we get next month. All right, guys. So that was it for this unboxing. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please give it a big ol' thumbs up for me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.